Greetings, everyone, and welcome. I want to share a dream with you. It's about your future husband. So I saw a young Asian mother standing holding a baby. She was single and having difficulty managing her concerns alone. Then the dream transitioned and a man, a husband, appeared in her kitchen. He began cooking for her. He made chocolate chip cookies and pancakes of different designs, which were very colorful and shaped like ice cream and rainbows. The husband said, I'm cooking breakfast for my wife. Then he broke off a piece of pancake and served her. Now for the revelation of this dream. This word is for single women. It doesn't matter if you're single with or without children desiring marriage. It may have been a difficult wait for getting your dear future husband, but keep the feet. I heard a saying before, there is someone for everybody. After hearing this quote, I questioned myself, where's mine? He probably is in another part of the world, or worse, not even born yet. Nevertheless, in your waiting, continue to pray God's perfect will according to the Holy Bible. Continue to live, work, bathe, eat. Don't sit obsessing over a fairy tale story or sit down crying. No, no, no. Think about this. Do you want to have the man on your list or the man according to God's perfect will? Let me encourage you with this. Pray, wait, listen, and obey the voice of the Lord. Command your faith to come alive. The word of God says, Nevertheless, to avoid fornication, let every man have his own wife and let every woman have her own husband. Learn what it means to submit. Also, it says, whosoever finds a wife finds a good thing and obtain it favor from the Lord. Therefore, in our state of singleness, we are to be prepping ourselves to be wives so that when the future husband comes, he finds a wife. In your waiting, learn to cook, fix your hair, clean your room. Do something to enhance yourself so you can be a blessing indeed to your husband. Remember what the scripture says now, your own husband, not someone else's. So I pray for everyone listening today that you will behold a new thing in your life concerning marriage. It shall spring forth and I pray God will even make a way in the wilderness and rivers in desert places of your life. In Jesus name. Amen.